In this movie, I'll be guiding you through how to set up LoopCloud and take your first steps with the software. So let's get started. Going right from the very beginning, you'll first need to click the Try LoopCloud for free button and then choose the plan that suits you best by clicking the Start Trial button to begin your 30 day free trial. Next up, you'll need to log in if you already have a LoopMasters account or fill out the email and password fields in the new customer area if not. Then on the final screen, you'll enter a billing address and payment method and hit the Start Now button. Now the free trial is underway, you can click to download the LoopCloud installer for Windows or Mac. This installs the main LoopCloud standalone app and accompanying plugin, as well as the two free instrument plugins from the suite, Drum and Play. Once downloaded, just double click the installer to run it and then follow the prompts on screen. Once installed, you can find LoopCloud in the Applications folder and can double click it to open. LoopCloud is a standalone app which can be used without a door or alongside one, with just a few differences to the way it functions in each mode, which we'll get onto in a moment. As default, it opens on the Home tab, which can be thought of as the store essentially, whilst clicking on the Library tab switches to displaying your own personal collection. The contents here will vary depending on whether you have any sample packs from the LoopMasters site, as they would show underneath here. But if not, you'll still see the free Sound Foundations pack, which is a gigabyte collection of samples to get you started. I can just click on folders to open them and then check out what's there. Then when I click on a sample, it loads straight into the player below and I can then use the play and pause buttons to start and stop the player. Or just use the spacebar on my keyboard. And the up and down arrows also move up and down the list. So I can do it all really easily from my keyboard. If I'm liking any of the sounds and I want to use them in a project, say, I can use the export button here to drag them out. You can see when I first click it, it downloads the sample. There'll be much more on this later, but the important thing to know is that you only download samples when you need them. So I can now drag this sample out to wherever I want. As default, the Loop Cloud app hides when a sample is dragged out with the export button, but this is a button preference that I've deactivated for the demo. And you can see the sample state now showing as on my computer as well as in the cloud, whilst all other samples just show as in the cloud. So although most samples in Loop Cloud are in the cloud, they can still be played and even edited and sequenced in the player right up until you finally need them. So you can get pretty far in the music making process before you have to commit to downloading any sounds. Going back to the Home tab then, here you can see all the new and exclusive sample packs and also preset packs for drum and play in the store. And can click on any to find out more. The Play button opens up the pack demo in the player. whilst the I button allows you to view the pack contents. The various tags at the top and buttons just below, and even all the audio filters can then be used to narrow down the pack contents to a very specific set of characteristics. To search for any sounds, you can use the search box and tag menus at the top to choose an instrument or genre, for example as well as the switches below choosing to search for one shots or loops in the store or library or both. And the audio filters allow you to even select things like tonal properties and length. Note that any samples that you don't own from the store are watermarked with noise and birdsong until you begin a paid subscription that is so the quality is a little different to sounds in your library. Again, it works the same way though. Whenever you're liking the sound of a sample, you can use the export button to first purchase it using however many of your points and then download and export it just like before. Although searching for samples in this way is still infinitely simpler with LoopCloud than any other technology, it really is just scratching the surface of what the app can do with the player allowing you to edit and build your own loops, as well as sequence up to eight tracks to create beats, full grooves and more. 
So the more you get to know the app, the later on you'll find yourself purchasing samples. Only when you're 100% ready to commit. Before we get to all that though, just a few final points on the plugins and working with Loop Cloud in and alongside the door. So here's the suite, which contains Loop Cloud, Loop Cloud Drum and Play. The Loop Cloud plugin can be added to a MIDI track when you want to use the Loop Cloud app with your door. You can think of it like a go-between really. As soon as you've added it, there are two fundamental differences in the app. Firstly, you can see it now says connected to Ableton Live in the corner. And this now means the player tempo is locked to lives, so it can now no longer be changed and will match whatever the project is doing. And secondly, any audio will now route from Loop Cloud onto the MIDI track in live. So you can hear if I play the project now, which has a drum loop in already, and then browse for bass loops in the store. You can hear the bass loops are synchronized with the beats in live. And the Loop Cloud audio is coming in on the MIDI track here. So working with the door running the Loop Cloud plugin allows complete tempo locked browsing, making finding samples to go with your music easier than ever before. And finally, the other plugins, Drum and Play, are two awesome instruments that you can add to MIDI tracks, allowing instant beat creation and playing of melodic parts like leads, keys, pads, bass lines, and more. So just a really quick intro there for getting started with Loop Cloud. Check out the other tutorials for more information about each part of the app and suite.